Okay, good week of preparations. I got tomorrow some meetings, we'll walk through, and then we'll get on the airplane. And looking forward to a great challenge, uh, playing a really good football team on the road. With that, I'll take any questions. So, Connie look good to go? Yeah, he looked, you know, he obviously uh, was sick, so good getting him back in here, and, and uh, it was nice seeing him out there at practice. Do you have any more details on Odell's status for Sunday beyond the questionable? Not really. What's it? I mean, we've seen him out here. He's looked good running around. So, I guess, what does that decision come down to? Yeah, I think he was limited today. So we'll use the next 48 hours with all these guys and determine uh, who's playing, who's not. We'll let you know 90 minutes before the game. And is that a decision that could come down to like, you know, watching him on Sunday morning, or do you think you'll know tomorrow? Yeah, I think for all these guys that were limited at practice, we'll make sure that we we huddle up over the next 48 hours and, and make decisions. He's not had any full contact, right? I mean, he has not been taken down and taken a hit on that knee at all? Correct. Okay. Yeah. Has he met the benchmarks that you guys had to be ready? Yeah, I think all the guys that are rehabbing from any injury, we make sure we follow the medical advice and, and go through the uh, rehab process like that. So he, he's no different. So, so it's, not like there was, it's not like there was any setback or no. anything that would make you guys listen to this question? No. Kevin, you guys believe in like snap counts or like a pitch count for a player or if they're available they need to be available for the whole game? I think for every single player uh, that comes into the game they have to be ready to play the whole game uh, but we as coaches and as a medical staff make sure that we have guys uh, are ready to do whatever they're capable to do so to answer your question yes there's a, a bunch of guys that, that you look at and you say alright he can go this many plays based on this. When Tech came back was was it pretty quick for him to get to where you wanted to see physically? Yeah, I think he's done a nice job out there, Zach. I think uh, just how attentive he is at the walkthroughs in the meeting room, coming out here in the practice field, playing really fast. He's, he's done a nice job. 93 degrees at kickoff. I assume that's something you've been stressing throughout the week as far as hydration and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's one of those other things that we don't control. Uh, we don't control the crowd noise. We don't control the heat. Uh, but we have to deal with it. We have to have a plan. Uh, so we've uh, made sure that the guys are, are understanding what they need to do really throughout the week to make sure that they're ready to go on Sunday. Kevin, are you going to uh, name captains like for the season, or are you doing game by game? Yeah, we're going to do the same thing that we did last year, Nate. We'll do game captains. Do you have your game captain? You're I do, but I'm not going to disclose it. We heard Good cheer out there. Was that what that was for? It was. Should have looked a little bit closer, Tom. Yeah, it's a Walk big huddle. What's, yeah. what's the uh, philosophy behind the, the game by game captain as opposed to team captain? Yeah, it's just how we do it. Daryl doesn't mean it's the right way to do it, but I uh, just feel like you don't need that C on the chest to be a leader and feel like each game highlighting one guy and what he means to the team uh, and having him be the captain is, is works better for us. How excited are you? Finally, get to play a game. You can stop talking and uh, just get out there and actually play. Yeah, I think a lot of the guys are excited about the opportunity to go compete. Uh, it's a great team we're playing, a great coaching staff, uh, so they understand the challenge and, and the task at hand. But that, that's the exciting part for these guys is to go watch them compete.